My name is Frank Fleming. I was born up in Northwest Alabama in the 1940s, to be exact, 1940. And uh, I was born on a small farm. Uh, as a child, I had a speech impediment that was very severe. It was a block. I couldn't get words started, and so I grew up mainly, pretty much so, as a mute uh, because I wasn't able to carry on conversations with my family. But however, I was able to talk to the animals and things like that. We had mules, and we had cows, and we had hogs, and we milked cows and plowed mules and slaughtered our hogs for food, and uh, we were small farmers. So I grew up that way, and uh, I think my family probably thought I was uh, pretty much uh, a little autistic or slow or mentally ill, whichever of those things fits in to categories like that. And so I just grew up that way, and it was the way it was, you know. It was, uh, and uh, entering my senior year, we had an agriculture teacher. They do not have those now, I don't think, who, who uh, taught, you know, running a farm and doing stuff like this, you know. This was a real rural area of Alabama, north of Jasper, south of Florence, joins the tenant the Mississippi border. So he had done some research and found out that there was a speech therapist at, at uh, Florence State College, which it was called then. It's now called University of North Alabama. And uh, he, uh, my senior year in high school, he arranged, so I went to Florence and lived with a family and did speech therapy for about eight hours a day. And, you know, this involved very small children up to adults, you know. So, so anyway, I progressed rather well, went back home to Bear Creek, and for my senior test or project, whatever it was, I did a... Uh, talk in front of my class and didn't have a lot of trouble, you know. It seemed like I was pretty much had control of it. And uh, so, being a country boy back then, the, uh, on the small farm boys went to uh, Detroit to work in car factories or the Army or the Navy, whichever, you know. So. Uh, I was sent away to college, paid for by the state Easter sales. And uh, I took therapy in the morning, then attended classes in the afternoon. And uh, I happened to take an art course and found, and found out I had quite a bit of art ability. So that was what was, that was, what brought me into art. 